Curse me, kilts. Me money bin alarm. Quick, Duckworth, get the limo. I shall uh, <clears throat> get out in gear, sir. Hurry, Duckworth, hurry! The pedal is to the middle, Mr. McDonald. the Beagle Boys again. If they think they can stand between Scrooge McDuck and his three cubic acres of cash, they've got another thing coming. Boy. Yeah, but you better watch out. The Beagle Boys mess with your security system. <laughs> yeah, we take them over the whole place. <laughs> yeah, be money. Hey, don't forget about me, Uncle Scrooge. Eh? Oh, 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 don't worry, lad, I'll save you. <laughs> Mama, be so proud. Ah, oh, that's a... oh, oh, oh. Now that's what I call a stomachache. You were hit on the head, you moronic marauder. Thanks, Uncle Scrooge. You're welcome, lad. But Huey, what are you doing here? Well, we saw the Beagle Boys going into the money bin. We? Sure. Louie and Dewey are here, too. You better hurry, Uncle Scrooge. We might be in trouble. Mrs. Beakley. What a beauty. Oh, it's a priceless ruby. Get away from him, you gluttonous goon! Sorry, Scroogey. Not a chance. I'm starving. Hmm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you saved me, Uncle Scrooge. I did. Are you hurt, lad? But I saw Louie heading up the stairs with about a thousand Beagle Boys right behind him. Stay here. I'll handle this. I'll have you free in a jiffy. Not so fast, McDuck. We're running things around here now. Curse me, Kilt. One false move and I'm a roast duck. Leave me, Uncle 
Scrooge, it's not worth it! Nonsense, my boy! You'll never beat us, Scrooge! Hey, when I get the gold, I'm gonna buy Ma a new hat! What are you waiting for, my duck? Ow! Woohoo! We almost got them all! A fat lot of good that will do us if they make it to me vault. How dare you! Step away from me, Fortune, you crook. Uh, 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 not this time, McDuck. Oh, you ain't getting the drop on this big old boy. That cane ain't gonna hide me that way. Your sail is securely suspended, son. There you are, sir. Oh, my yanking head! Ouch! Ha! Oh dear, do be careful or you'll scuff the floor. Who keeps a safe hanging from the ceiling? Curse you, muck duck! This ain't the last you'll see of me! Eh, good riddance to bad beagles, I say. Now, why in the world was he interested in this old painting? Surely there are more valuable... Well, pluck me pin feathers! It looks like some kind of secret code. Boys! Boys! What did you find, Uncle Scrooge? Yeah, what is it? I'm not sure. But I know how to find it out. I'll feed it into my supercomputer and use Gyro's new crypto analysis program. Then we'll know what the Beagle Boys were after. <laughs> Stand back, lads. Brigadoon! What is it, Uncle Scrooge? It's a treasure map, lads. And no ordinary treasure by the look of things. Only Uncle Scrooge would call any kind of treasure ordinary. Look! One of the treasures is in the middle of the Amazon! And there's another one in Transylvania! And one buried ten miles underground! Hey, wait a minute! Something screwy! This last treasure can't be right! Yeah, there's no mountain on Earth that's that high! Well, according to the Junior Woodchuck's guidebook, to get there we'd have to take about 537 million steps straight up till we reach the moon. You mean the moon moon? It looks that way, lads. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? That treasure's not going to discover itself. Get launch pad on the horn. I'm headed to the Amazon jungle to find the scepter of the Incan king. Thanks for the lift, Launchpad. No problemo. Lift is one of my favorite principles of aerodynamics. Oh, say, you got your radio, Mr. McD? Hi, hey, of course I do. Great, then I'll be your eyes in the sky. Oh, I'd be happy if you just keep your eyes on the sky for once. What an airhead. Hey, I heard that. 
Now then, ancient Incan legends claim the King's Scepter was locked away in a giant temple of the clouds, and it should be dead ahead. Gee, Mr. McGee, I see a lot of clouds, but no temple. You wouldn't launch, bud. The legend says the temple was hidden away from all but King Manco Capquac himself. But there's bound to be a way to reveal it buried somewhere in this overgrown salad bowl. And I'm not leaving till I find it. Launchpad, I found an ancient coin depicting a nightingale. Hey, no. You haven't stumbled across a pizza joint down there, have you, Mr. McD? I'm getting kind of hungry up here. Uh, I'm not even going to dignify that question with a response. Another coin, and this one has an inscription of an eagle. Oh. Aha! A coin bearing the image of the Queen's horse. Ha, it'll help us find the treasure for sure. Never doubt the well-honed instincts of an experienced treasure hunter. If you say so, Mr. McDee. Treasure! <laughs> A coin showing the sun. Gads, I nearly tripped over it. This place is a mess. Where's Mrs. Beakley when you need her? <laughs> 